Hi everyone, and welcome back to RPG Thursdays, where we are playing, there we go, No Man's Sky. Now I realize that this is a little more, more in the open world end of things, open universe even, than it is the RPG end of things, but you know, it still kind of counts for what I wanted to do with this, so let's find out what planet we end up on. I started over more out of necessity than, than out of want, because... It's not important, but basically I lost my save. So we're starting over. And I haven't actually played this since all of the newest updates and stuff, so it'll be interesting. We'll discover together. All right, where are we gonna be? What's this planet gonna be like? Oh, I have to hold it, my bad. <laughs> Ooh, it looks tropical. I like this better already. Well, actually, no, I take that back. That looks like snow. It's super toxic, and it's negative 51 degrees Celsius. Alright, I take it back. Get back in the spaceship. It's not worth it. This planet's a bust. No? No, I think my spaceship's a bust, isn't it? If I remember correctly. And this hasn't changed that much in the beginning. That... I don't know what that is, but it looks like a green cake. Alright. Cool, let's go- let's go mine some stuff. Oh! Oh. 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 It's third person now? Crisp enforcing- oh, I missed the words. Uh, analyze. Uh, I, I think that's the explode button. Yeah, you think? You think my external temperature is dangerously low? You think, maybe? Oh, of course it is. So I have to find some ferrite dust. Well, I mean, I found it, but I don't remember how to do anything. Repair immediately. This doesn't seem to be working. Shooting small rocks. It says shoot small rocks. Alright, are these not small enough? Are they too small? They're too small. Alright. See how it is. Gotta specify between your small rocks and your sort of small rocks. Repair, scan, or damage. Can do. Can do. Can do. And did I, did I do it? I did it. I think I did it? That sounded like I did it. That sounded like I did it right. So, scan. D uh, small yellow plants. I see small green plants. Is that... Cobalt? What? Uh, are these yellow? Those don't look yellow to me. I don't see yellow. Oh god, I'm gonna die before I even get started. I see what you mean. Am I doing it wrong again? Oh, I have to pick it. Alright, that's fair. That's fair. Okay, so if I recharge and do that... I'm gonna do it the complicated way, because I don't understand what just happened. Yes, charge with sodium. There we go. Alright, so I'm not freezing to death anymore, I don't think. It sounds like happy noises. Automated. Let's search this. What could possibly- Oh, I can't search it. Never mind, I won't search it. Fine, I'll just run this way. This seems to be a little more guided than the first time I started it up, which is probably for the better. I don't mind these kind of survival-y, collect -y things, and I wasn't even one of the ones who was, like, majorly against this game when it first came out because I was thinking, hey, it didn't give me what it promised. I was fine with it, for the most part, but I do appreciate that it now has what seems to be more of a guided introduction than I remember. There's a little bit. 
A lot of people had a really, really bad reaction to this when it came out because I guess they didn't read the description or they didn't think it was... I don't know what they thought, but clearly it wasn't up to their standards and they got really angry about it. And I don't really know what they were complaining about. It wasn't fully everything I wanted or expected, that's true, but there were a lot of people who were like, Oh, we wanted base building! Oh god, what is that? We wanted base building, which is the thing you can do now. And I'm like, what did they- they advertised how many planets? Like 15 quintillion or something? Regardless of whether that number is accurate or not, which it's impressive, I don't know how accurate it is, but why would you play an open universe space sim with a spaceship and build a base on a single planet and stay there forever? You know what you just invented? Real life. Congratulations. Go outside. The stress beacon. Ooh. Best cause. Okay. Okay. Sure, I'll broadcast that. Why not? What could possibly go wrong? Probably nothing? I don't know. Is this my- oh, my spaceship's over- how did I end up over there? What did I do? Like, jump out of it? I'm just gonna collect these plants. Oh, whoa, everything is vibrating. I think I just caused an earthquake. Use oxygen to fuel the life support systems. All right, so I'm just gonna do that so I don't die immediately. Okay, investigate the crashed ship. I, well, I said investigate, not get inside, but I guess this is easier than doing it outside. It's on fire though. I don't think I need to get inside to tell that my ship's on fire. <laughs> I don't know about you. Should I perform maintenance? Should I? Should I perform maintenance when my ship's on fire? Really? Thank you. Thank you for letting me know. Hermetic seal and metal plating. Both of those sound like things I'm definitely gonna find on this planet. More ferrite dust. There's nothing around here. There's literally nothing. Alright, there's one rock. Fine, I'll go collect ferrite dust from this single rock. No, I won't. I'll collect it from this rock. Fine. Just like humans. We discover a brand new planet, and what do we do? We mine. Oh, okay. Alright. Fair enough, fair enough. Okay, so I'm gonna go slap this on the side and maybe put the fire out with it. Because I'm sure that metal is good for putting out fires. Oh, I think I... I did... Uh, hang on. Okay, so here we go, and then I slap it on the... Yeah, slap it on the... There! Slap it on the thing and it's all better now, except for the other bit that I have to get. How is there a hermetic seal just nearby? Did it just fall off in one piece and I have to... Okay, you know what? Why not? Let's go investigate. Let's go investigate, shall we? Locate... Lo get out of this ship first. There we go. Yeah, it's literally just sitting right here. What? Mm. How did it... How and or why did it fall off then in the first place? Clearly it didn't fall off much. Take planetary chart? Sure, why not? That's not a hermetic seal, but... Um... Okay, plot route. Sure. Whoa! That was not what I was expecting. I was expecting that to be wholly unhelpful until I got into space. Okay. Reach the marked- oh, this is gonna take forever! What's a U? I know what an AU is. What's a U? Hopefully not nearly as long. Oh! Oh, I'm in a hole! I'm in a hole. I'm in a hole. I'm- ooh! Yep. Hello. Oh, don't go farther into the hole. Is it- There we go. I have yet to see an animal. I saw a mean plant. I want to see the animals. I want to see how much they have changed. Because if I had anything, um, 
against the, like I said, I, I liked the base game as it was. It was fine. Um, as far as I was concerned, it was everything I expected, I guess, is accurate. But the one thing I did find lacking, oh god, a blizzard, is that the um, creature and animal variety was not quite as varied, <laughs> for lack of a better word, than I had wanted, than I expected. That was the one thing that kind of, um, you know, they were basically just sticking different bits together in different pieces, like a Mr. Potato Head of aliens. Why am I on the snow planet? I already live on a snow... Oh, oh. I, I don't think that helped me. And I'm in a cave. Well, I can't get out of the cave, so I live here now. It's warmer in the blizzard than it was not in the blizzard? Or is it because I'm in a cave? Is the blizzard done? Can I get out of here now? I want to get out, please. Help. I'm stuck in a hole. Oh yeah, that's a storm, all right. Too... That's good. I don't feel like living in a cave for years, all right? I'm just gonna outrun it. Storm crystal. Ooh, that sounds cool. I have no idea what use that's gonna... An animal! <gasps> what is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Hello? You look like a... Dinosaur cat. Oh, and it's scared. Oh, that's cute. Come back. You're my only friend. You're the only thing I've seen. Hi, hello. Oh, creature pellets. That doesn't sound like something I'd feed to it. It sounds like something that would happen after I feed it. What's this then? Got a couple buildings. Got a garage, looks like, maybe. Got another crash thing. I wonder if I can open this crash thing. Let's go try and open this crap. Is this where I started? It looks kind of... I mean, everything looks the same. It's covered in snow and... Now it's dark. So, chromatic metal. Yeah. Hell if I know where to get that. So let's go inside here and see what's up. An archive. That's not a hermetic seal. Am I still looking for that? Did I find it? Ooh, a fabricator. So I'm just gonna steal your stuff. Oh, sweet. All right, thank you. Are you sure it's not you? Maybe it's you. I wouldn't be surprised if it was you. That would be a very video game thing to do. Uh, can... yeah. All right, and do I have to walk all the way back now? Uh, carbon nanotubes. Yeah, I'm sure I'll just find those in the wilderness. Uh, okay. Alright. Cannot build missing components. Gather carbon. Haven't I already done that? Wait, so I have to mine that plant, but I can't mine the- Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna ask questions. Deuterium is not carbon. Deuterium is hydrogen, if I remember chemistry correctly. <laughs> An isotope of hydrogen. Where can I find carbon? Your plants, do you have carbon? I mean, hazmat gauntlet. Okay, I don't know what that is, but it sounds enormous and nearby and not like something I want to mess with. Can you stop screaming, please? I'm just gonna go this way and hope it's not this way because I really don't like the sound of that. Do you give me carbon? What are you even? You're like... <laughs> okay. Ice potatoes. Ah! God, all I wanted to do was take your carbon. It's no reason to beat me up, stupid plant. Come on now. If you just point me in the direction of the carbon, instead of beating me up. We can all live peacefully. F for real though? For real though. Where? Eh? Uh, 
If I was carbon, where would I be? Literally everywhere. Surely there's carbon in this tree. Don't tell me we're on a planet that has like ammonia-based life forms because we're gonna be in a real pro- also, I don't actually know what's in ammonia. Maybe it has carbon. Is it, whatever, as long as it has carbon, I really don't- there we go. That's how plants work. Give me your carbon. And all the carbon in the world. More carbon? Yes. Uh, alright, well I guess I'm gonna have to punch it. Does that still work? Am I getting carbon? I am. <laughs> when in doubt, punch it! Alright, that should... Yeah, that's more than enough. Okay, so, now I have to... What is this? Sure. Make some bread later, why not? Multi-tool. Multi-pass. Uh, mining beam, yes, I need to recharge that. And I need to... Make carbon nanotubes. How to craft an empty- oh, oh, I'm getting way ahead of myself. Getting way ahead of myself. There we go. Put some... None of- none of this is the- No! I used 80 to recharge my- Well. Fine, I guess I'll just go punch more trees. Alright. Try this again, shall we? Build some carbon nanotubes. Okay, now what? Finalize installation. Multi tool install. Doop, doop, doop. Did I do it? I did it! I think I did it. I think I did it. Cool, now I can analyze things. Whoa! If I'm. It's a rock, but sure, let's scan it. Yep, it's a rock! Ooh, a mysterious monolith. Let's go rub my face up to it, uh, next to it. Whatever, something. Hi. Yes. A vision. Yeah, all right. Cool. What is it? Is it something important? I learned, really? I learned the geck word for geck? Is it Gek? That was really worth stroking a weird pillar for. Alright, whatever. Let's go repair my ship. Okay, okay. Everything's repaired. Woo! I repaired it! Oh, I didn't repair it enough, though. Dang it. Alright, fine. Fine, I'll go collect more stuff, see if I care. What is- <gasps> Oh! Another ship! Cool, 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 cool. Cool. Uh, craft it in the inventory. There we go. Do I only need one? I'm gonna assume I only need one and just- it's probably fine. All right, thing number four. Construct a portable refiner, craft metal plating. Craft metal plating, okay. Uh, advanced material, deploy the portable refiner. What? Did I do something wrong? Almost certainly. Um, what? Access the build menu. Oh, 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 oh. All right, all right. Yeah, I'll just put it there. Why not? Um, then what do I do? Do this, and I put carbon in it. And I... Ugh. So many steps. All right, hold on. I'm gonna punch more trees. Charge that. Put in my metal plating. Put in my ferrite dust, rather. Yep, put that right there. Begin. 
<coughs> Collect that. Put that there, I guess. I don't know. And then just go slap it on the spaceship. Alright, we're good. Good to go. The fire's out. We're all... Let's leave this hell planet. Oh, I have to... Whoops. Yeah, let's... That's a good idea. Actually, let's collect this thing first. And then let's get off of this hell planet. W to take off. Whoa! Yeah, look at me! I'm flying through space. Seek answers among the stars. Woo! Oh god, I went too far. Whee! Am I- am I doing this right? I honestly don't know. I don't seem to be in space yet, so no. Get in there, get in there. Nice! In the Euclid Galaxy. Seems an appropriately scientific name for it. Orbital flight achieved. All right, that seems to work. Left shift. Oh my god! Yeah, that works. Hold space to test pulse engine. Now let's not pulse engine towards whatever that is, yeah? Oh! Oh, I went- oh, oh god! Oh, rocks! Oh, okay. That's- yeah, that works. Whew. Message. Uh, X. Select? Who's contacting me? Who and how? Hello. I'm not alone. Is that a good or a bad thing? Planetary coordinates. Alright, let's go to this new planet, I guess. Okay. Alright. And find the signal. Ooh, it's over there. Oh, wow. Wow, space. So much space. Arrive in two days. Sure, I do. Whee! I don't have much pulse active. Pulse engine remaining. Fuel, that's the that's the one. I'm going through an awful lot of rocks. I feel like my spaceship is probably gonna be busted up again by the time I land. Uh, that's alright, I'll just punch some more trees, it'll be fine. Alright, I'm approaching the site. Approaching the site at a quite sharp angle, I think? I can't quite tell. This looks more hospitable than the last planet, though. It looks green as opposed to white, which is a plus. I would prefer vegetation to snow any day, any day, time, something. We're gonna land right here. Ooh, 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 we're gonna land here softly. Calmly. Calmly, calmly. Not on top of anybody. It's a nice... Nice little, uh, yeah. Cool. Oh, so I am alone is what you're telling me. They said I wasn't alone. Liars. Chromatic metal. Yep, and a terrain manipulator. Okay, well with that, I think it's time to end. Oh, oh, what's that noise? Is that a good noise? Bad noise? What was that noise? Uh, I'm getting back in here, so maybe my life's... Anyway. I think that has been enough for this first little um, jaunt into No Man's Sky. Um, it, so far, it's not much like, or it's it's much it is much like rather. Uh, I remember it being. I don't. Um, I haven't gotten into any of the base building yet, though. It sounds like that's about kind of where it's headed right now. Uh, we didn't see many weird monsters this time. A lot of it was spent punching trees, and there was a good chunk of time there where it took like 
I, my game kept freaking out and it took quite a bit longer to do what I wanted to um, than I had hoped. But I hope you enjoyed it. We'll co probably come back and visit again. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna exit this before it yells at me. And point save, there we go. All right, so I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you um, come back for more, more RPG Thursdays, more mostly horror uh, for October. This is a little bit of the exception to the rule for this month because it is the month of Halloween. But I wanted to get this in there, uh, explore it a little bit more. I don't know, some of the monsters in this are pretty scary looking. So I, you know, We'll see. If you did like this video, please consider liking it, subscribing down there, and hit the bell icon if you want to know when I upload videos. And I will see you in the next one. Bye!